Uh, I'm Hongshan. Uh, fortunately or unfortunately, this is a real blockchain talk. Um, so we heard a lot about the blockchain in the uh, past days. So yeah, Nagamoto's original design is amazingly cool. Uh, it's based on a, a really simple uh, Hashi, Hashi inequality. It has a lot of like features. I list uh, six of them. You can list more. So based on these uh, uh, features, we can see uh, the protocol is really secure. For example, the protocol has lower communication complexity. And uh, that means uh, it can be executed uh, over a large scale network. Uh, ideally, it's supposed to be very difficult uh, for the adversary to control the majority of mining power because the miners are widely distributed. Um, the protocol, as you see in the previous slide, so the protocol, um, it's non-negative, which is great in the sense that it's resilient to network delay. There are lots of other features. I have no time because. However, there's a caveat. If you were in Professor Mikali's talk on, on Saturday, you will see that Bitcoin, uh, Bitcoin blockchain are dominated by a very small number of um, bigger miners, right? Which is bad. Uh, in addition. Uh, Bitcoin mining is a huge waste of uh, computing resource, waste of electricity. Um, we want to fix that. There are several ways. Um, you may try to use uh, SGX. Even as SGX, the trust hardware is trusted, there is still a single point of failure concern. You can use uh, multi-party computation, but there is a caveat. Uh, some researchers try to use uh, hash inequality, and uh, yeah, Professor Mikali tried to use uh, hash inequality and the BFT. So here, we do not want to use BFT because uh, BFT requires a stronger network assumption. Okay. So how to do? So our first step is to have uh, um, uh, alternative, a new alternative uh, um, hash inequality. Instead of having the random nuns as a solution, we ask uh, miners to generate the unique signatures as a, as a solutions. So this looks very similar to uh, Professor Mikali's uh, construction. There's a big difference. So in Argoran design, the hygiene inequality is pretty uh, simple, easy. Uh, multiple miners will be chosen. Okay, sorry. Multiple, multiple miners will be chosen. Then they run a BFT to define a block. So here, we, the, the, the hash inequality is very difficult. Only one miner will be chosen, as in Bitcoin. Okay. We try to mimic Bitcoin. So this um, uh, design is uh, already pretty good in the sense that uh, if malicious miners, they follow the longest chain, uh, it only extend the long chain, then we can see it's secure, it works. However, in proof of stake setting, malicious miners, they may extend the long chain, the single long chain, the third long chain, and so on. So this is called a nothing at stake a concern. So the previous understanding of nothing at stake a concern is quite limited. We discovered that if you play the nothing at stake strategy, you can benefit. However, you can amplify your stakes. However, your amplification rate is, is, is bounded by um, uh, constant E, which is 2.7, right? And uh, based on this, we can play a nothing at stake attack against nothing at stake. Okay, all these players play another stake uh, strategy to defend against the malicious uh, uh, nothing stake strategy. So we can see, we can get uh, like a good, nice protocol. Of course, there are other concerns. Uh, we, we will have like a fine grain, a greedy, uh, whatever strategy, uh, uh, multiple, stra okay, sorry. One more time. Okay, so, so yeah, I have more. Uh, we can improve the throughput. Yeah, finally, uh, we also have a project ongoing. Uh, it's a very early stage called a fractal uh, with uh, someone you know. <laughs> okay, that's it. Thanks. <laughs>